it's a place where I love to be. Look in a book, here's a story for you. Who makes stories when the day is through? Who makes stories when the day is through? Story makers, story makers. Working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story makers. Stories are fabulous, stories are fun. Shelley Wordsworth. Shelley and Jackson. Working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story makers. Stories are fabulous, stories are fun. Come and be a story maker. Time to go home. Come on, off we go. Night in the library. Hello. Time for all story makers to come out. Are you ready? The sun is down, the stars are bright. Story makers come out at night. Hello, I'm Shelley Wordsworth. Come on, let's have some fun and make some stories. Oh, it's really dirty in here, Jackson. And dusty too. Mm, I'll soon get wrapped. <laughs> swish, swish, swish. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh. Uh, we're wearing our cleaning uniforms. Yeah, ta-da. <laughs> <laughs> and look at me. Yeah, mm. Jackson's wearing his cleaning dungarees. <laughs> mm. The children in the library today had a tidy up. Day. Hmm. Yeah, and so we're making everything clean and sparkling, aren't we, Jackson? Yes, we are, Jelly. Mm. <laughs> I go swish, swish, swish with my feathery thingy and just look at all the dust. <laughs> <laughs> and I go rub a dub dub, mm. rub a dub <laughs> dub. It's very oh, dusty love in here. Cleaning, rub a dub oh, cleaning. Mm, I, I love, love cleaning. cleaning. Oh, swish, uh, swish, swish, shoo. swish. Oh, dear. I love because we're oh. cleaning. Yeah. Oh, right, so that's what you're doing. Yes, we're yeah. rubber dub dubbing Yeah, and swish, swish, swishing. And oh. making the library sparkly clean. Yeah. Oh, I see. Mm. So that's why you're wearing these funny clothes. Uh, funny mm. clothes? Yes. No, Shelley. These are our cleaning uniforms. Yes. Oh. They're to stop us from getting dirty. Oh, yeah. okay. Oh. <laughs> Help. Mm. Do you want to help? Oh, well, no, I mean, you That's know... That's great just, fun. Yeah. Uh, Come great on, fun. Shelley. Rub -dub -dub. Rub -dub -dub -dub. Come on. Okay, okay, yeah. I'll just find a duster. Yeah, oh. great. Oh, here we are. Oh, Shelley, oh, oh, Shelley. Oh, oh, you, oh, can't, you can't, you can't oh, clean up dressed oh, like that. Oh, can't I? No, no oh. Shelley, you mm. make all your pretty clothes dirty. Yeah. Oh, yes, you're right. Yeah. You need a cleaning uniform like us. Yeah. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Okay, well, that's easy. Um, okay. Just just swish me some dust, okay, Princess? Okay, mm. swish, swish. Okay, musty, flusty, magic, dusty. Ah, wow. 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 <laughs> what are we waiting for? Yes. Come on. We love cleaning. Swish, 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 swishing. We love cleaning. Cleaning over here. Cleaning over here. Swish, 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 swish. That's enough cleaning for me. Ah, come on, everyone. Time for a story break. Oh, goody. Come on, Jackson. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Shelley, mm. where's your uniform? Well, I put it in the story machine. Oh, but Shelley, mm? that was your cleaning uniform. Yes. Um, well, mm. it could make a uniformy story. Uh, oh. oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yes? Okay, yes. Ready with your imagination? Oh, yes, yeah, we mm. need lots of imagination. Mm. Because imagination's what makes the machine work. That's yeah. right. Let's make a uniformy story. Yeah. Imagine, imagine, imagine a story. Mm. Mm. It's so exciting. It is. Oh, yes. oh it's a playbook. Mm. Mm. Oh, 
and it's called My Dad the Policeman. My Dad wears shiny shoes. What job does he do? My Dad wears a uniform. I know what he does. Do you? My Dad wears a pointy hat. That should be another clue. My Dad drives a car. The light on top flashes blue. My Dad has a radio and there's one at the station too. My Dad's in a hurry when he's off to the rescue. My dad is a policeman. One day, after dad had gone to work, and after I'd finished my breakfast, I went to the park with my mum. I love going to the park. I took my favourite purple ball, and when we got there, I played football. I gave the ball a big kick, and it bounced and landed in the woods. I went to look for my ball, but I couldn't find it anywhere. I looked under all the trees and bushes. I couldn't find my purple ball anywhere, but I did find something else. It was someone's wallet. Let's take it to Dad, said Mum. And we went straight to the police station. When we got to the police station, I went straight to my dad and showed him the wallet. Dad looked carefully at the wallet. And wrote some notes in the lost property book. But just as Dad wrote down the colour of the wallet, the phone rang. It was a man. I lost my wallet. It's brown with a zip. But don't worry, said Dad. My daughter just found it and we've got it right here. As a reward, Mum bought me a big ice cream. And just then, another policeman walked down the hall and guess what he had? My favourite purple ball. Mmm, ice cream and my favourite ball. <laughs> Come on, Mum, let's get back to the park. Bye, Dad. <laughs> that was a great story. Oh, right. yeah. On with the cleaning. Oh, dear. Bless mm. you. Um, Thank you. Shelley? Yes? Uh, Aziza was lucky the policeman found her ball, wasn't oh, she? Yes, she was, Princess. Mm. Very lucky. Yeah, and didn't her dad mm. have shiny boots mm. and a nice smart uniform? Yes, yeah, yes. not like mine. Well, that's because he's a policeman. Uh, my uniform's all dirty. Well, that's because you're Jelly, the cleaner. And Smeary. Oh, dearie. Oh, oh. Jelly, mm. I don't want to be a cleaner anymore. Oh, poor Jelly. Mm. OK, do you want to change your dirty, smeary, cleany uniformy? Um, yes, please, yes? Jelly. Yes? OK, good. Mm. Here goes, then. Um, Jelly? Yes? I think you're wonderful. Oh, mm. thank you, Jellykin. No. Oh. Mm. OK, here goes. <clears throat> Shimmery, shinery, magic finery. <laughs> you look great. Oh, yes, I do, don't I? Mm. Well, so do you, Jellykins. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Oh. Well, these uniforms are lovely. Mm. Mm. But uh, what are they for? These Jellykins are marching uniforms. <gasps> oh. Shall we march? Oh, yes, yes. Come along. Mm. Left, march, 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 march. Good idea! Yeah, can oh. you help us? Imagine! Imagine! Imagine a story! It's taking a long time. Yeah. Oh, it's a three bear story. Oh, and it's called Grand Old Mr. Bossy Boo. There's a house in the woods that's cosy and neat Where three furry creatures are waiting to eat the porridge is ready. Hip, hip, hooray! 
But who will come for breakfast with the three bears today? Poor Father Bear. All he wanted was some peace in the morning to eat his breakfast. But who could that be knocking at the door? Baby Bear skipped over to answer it. If it's Goldilocks, tell her to come back later. She's a proper nuisance, said Father Bear. But it wasn't Goldilocks. It was a man with a long beard. Ah, hello, Bear. I am the Duke of York, but you can call me Sir. He marched into the kitchen. Right, lift, right, lift. What's this? No salutes. Tut tut. Sorry, Sorry sir. sir. The three bears all saluted. Now I need three more soldiers for my army. Line up, please. Oh, goody! Mm -hmm. Giggled Baby Bear. Let's count you then. One, mm -hmm. two, mm -hmm. three, mm -hmm. four. Oh. Oh. Haven't I seen your face before, little bear? Back in line, please. Good try, Barry. One, two, hello, three. Splendid. Oh, I want my pony. Show us back, Father Bear. Oh, I'll have oh, no slouching oh, in my army. Oh, I've got an itch, said Mother Bear, twitching her nose. Pause at your side, soldier. <laughs> I'll have no itchy twitching. Oh, wow. <laughs> Isn't he bossy? What? Silence! <gasps> I'll have no whispering in the ranks. Now then, soldiers, present your spoons for inspection. Oh, right. Hmm. Oh. Gooey. Yeah. Ooey. And gloopy. Oh, well. Let's see what you're like at marching. Follow me, please. One, two, three, four. Oh, the grand old Duke of York. He had three marching bears. He marched them round the table legs and up and down the stairs. And when they were up, they were up. We're up, sir. And when they were down, they were down. Oh, we're down, sir. And when they were only halfway up, oh, I wish he'd make his mind up. They tumbled all the way down. I don't want to be a soldier anymore. I want my breakfast. Here, here. Here. Mother Bear and Father Bear agreed. I'm the one that gives the orders around here. Now, <laughs> prepare to eat. But uh, what can we eat? How about a bowl of porridge, sir? Grinned Father Bear. <laughs> yes, well said. Prepare to eat porridge. They all sat down to a porridgey feast, and Mother Bear added a special treat. It's crushed nuts today. Crushed nuts, yum yum. Tuck in, everyone. <laughs> that was a funny story. Oh yes, it was. Oh, but the three bears weren't very good at marching, were they? No, oh. and the Duke was so bossy. Yes, yes, he was. Mm. Mm -mm. Oh, oh. Shelley, mm? uh, can we have another story? What, already? Mm, I'm tired. Oh, yes, it mm. has been a busy old night, that's for sure. Mm. Um, what can we use for the machine? Uh, well, I'll see what Jackson mm. thinks. Oh, OK, well, I'll meet you at the story machine. Oh, oh look at all these lovely pictures. Mm. Oh, that one's a fire engine. <laughs> Jackson! Oh, Jenny, you look nice. Yeah, mm. that's because I've been marching. Oh. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Can you help me make a story? Oh, yes, yes, yes. We can use one of the children's pictures. Oh, mm. yes. Uh, but which one? <laughs> you choose, Jelly. Uh, look, there's a nice fire engine. Uh, mm. Yeah, but I like that helicopter. Oh, mm. Jelly, uh, you mean a helicopter. Uh, mm. Yeah, that's what I said. A helicopter. <laughs> come on, mm. let's put it in the machine. Yeah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> We've got a picture. Oh, great, we'll put it in then. Yeah. In it goes. <laughs> now we just need to use our imagination. Yeah. Imagine. Imagine. Imagine a story. Yeah. Come on. Ah, yeah. it's a blue cow story. Yeah. And it's called Blue Cow to the Rescue. Yeah. In a field not far away is a herd of cows grazing quietly. 
One of the cows is most unusual. Blue cow wonders. Wonders about the big world beyond her field. One day, Blue Cow was listening to the sound of a fire engine. I wonder what it would be like to rescue someone. She's off again, said the other cows. So Blue Cow caught the bus that stops beside her field. I'd like a ticket to somewhere I can rescue someone, please. There you go, madam. Hold very tight. And they set off for the mountains. And then they arrived. In front of Blue Cow was a helicopter, and there was a man shouting and waving at her. Oh, thank goodness you're here! Jump in, said the man. Blue Cow climbed into the helicopter, and it took off into the sky. I'm Pete, and this is Fred. Hello, I'm Blue Cow. Um, what's happened? She said. There are two goats trapped on the mountain side, and we have to save them before it gets dark. Oh dear! Said Blue Cow. Oh, don't worry. We can rescue them now that you're here. Pete gave Blue Cow a jacket with a lot of straps. Fred can't land the helicopter on the mountain side. It's too dangerous. Oh dear! Said Blue Cow. Someone has to be lowered down to save the goats. Goodness me! Said Blue Cow. That's very brave. Uh, yes. Um. Uh, will you do it? Said Pete. Me? Said Blue Cow. Oh please! I don't like heights. Blue Cow wasn't too fond of heights either. Okay, she said, trying to be brave. Great! Great said Pete and Fred together. Soon they could see the goats on the mountain side. Here we go! Said Pete. Blue cow stepped out of the door of the helicopter. Blue cow to the rescue! Woo! And she was lowered down on a line. Hello, she said to the goats. Oh, we're, we're so, so glad, glad you're, you're here. here. But which goat should she rescue first? I know. One of you grab my front legs, and the other grab my back legs. So up they went to the helicopter with both goats hanging from Blue Cow's legs. Good, Good work, work, Blue, Blue Cow. Cow, said Pete and Fred. You'll never guess where I've been. Where have you been? I've been in a helicopter and I did a rescue. Everyone knows that cows can't do rescues. But we know they can, don't we? Oh, Blue Cow was a very brave rescuer, wasn't she? Oh, she, she was. Yes. She yes. Was. <laughs> oh, look, it's getting light. Oh. But that's the dawn, Jaxie. It's time for us to disappear. Yeah, hmm? the children will be here soon. That's right. Dawn is upon us. The morning is nigh. We've made our stories, and we bid you goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> Story makers, story makers, working through the night till the rising sun. Story makers, story See you makers, soon. Bye. Stories are fun. Thanks for helping us. Bye. Bye bye, story makers. Come back soon. Story makers, story makers.